Hi, I'm Joe Iconis. Hi, I'm Lauren Marcus. And, and this, this is, is the story, story of, of our, our first, first date. I was newly 21, so I'd been out drinking the night before a lot, and I was really, really hungover. And I had um, a message on my phone, um, and I was like, hey, uh, this is Joe Iconis, and um, uh, I'm doing this reading last minute today of um, a show I wrote called Black Suits, and uh, I, I want you to come do it, but if you don't call me back in 10 minutes, then I have to ask somebody else. And I was like, what? And I knew who he was, and I knew his music, and I pulled myself together because I was 21 then, and you can will yourself to be fine. And I called him back, and I was like, great. And then we uh, met, I think, in the like lobby of Telsey that mm -hmm. day. Yes. Like so many great relationships formed in the lobby of Telsey. Mm. From the first time that we uh, worked together, there was probably a, you know, maybe six months oh, to yeah, a like year a, yeah, yeah, yeah. of us uh, sort of dancing around each other. And um, then we did, uh, I did like a night of my songs at the D Lounge. I said out loud to the audience that I had a huge crush on Lauren. And and like that, all of our parents were there. Yeah, and it was like a whole thing. And you, you were seeing someone at the time. Yeah. I was. Yeah, it was it was kind of an asshole move on my part. Or was it a brilliant move? Because here we are. Both. Um, so then that kind of led to this night where Joe asked if he, I wanted to go see a musical theater concert with him at the beach. Ars Nova. At Ars Nova. And we just got drunker and drunker and drunker. Got very drunk at the very concert. Very drunk. And then we ended up at a bar that uh, Fusion. We're on bar stools at Fusion. I fell off my bar stool and I <laughs> fell into a glass and I uh, shattered the glass. I think maybe you were bleeding. You came down to the floor with me mm -hmm. and um, we kissed. There was blood and glass. It was exactly like the, I guess, first scene of Merrily. Um, it was. And then somebody, pulled, Brent Stranathan, pulled mm -hmm. us off the floor and was like, you guys got to go home. <laughs> and then the last thing I remember is he put us in a car. He had a car there for some reason. Yeah. I was in the car at the window. <laughs> this is so dumb. I was in the car at the window like this. And Joe was going. I think that was kind of our first date. Pretty rock and roll. So we dated for about like just shy of a year. And then we uh, broke up for like three and a half, four years. Yeah, mm -hmm. my fault. Our breakup was so uh, unusual because we, we broke up and then immediately did like 10 million shows together. And then we just uh, saw each other and worked together in a very uh, intense, intimate it capacity for like a half a year. And then uh, Marcus went to school in uh, Scotland for a year. And that was like the first time that we had never been seeing each other semi-regularly. And uh, I think that, for me at least, sort of made me realize, like, wait a minute, this, this person is someone who I want to see very much regularly. I remember it was like uh, April, mm -hmm. and I was working at a restaurant, um, and I got asked out by someone who came into the restaurant and I remember thinking like, They're, the only person I wanna go out with is Joe, this is stupid. And so on the subway ride home, I emailed him and I just said, um, do you wanna get a drink? And I remember you emailed back, yes, yes, yes. And then we, st we started dating. So. Then we like started dating for real. There was this one night, I remember in like 2011, and we were on the fire escape at your old um, apartment. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. And like we'd just been dating like a month or two, round two. And you turned to me and you were like, do you ever think about the future? And I was like, yeah. And you're like, do you ever think about um, like us in the future? And I was like, yeah. And you said, oh my God, I'm gonna cry. And you're like, do you ever think about us growing old together? And I went, yeah. And then I was like, oh yeah, we're gonna be together the rest of our lives. 